Health alert tonight, Americans love coffee, of course. In fact, when asked in a recent survey, 64% of us claimed we drank coffee the previous day. So the results of a brand new study by German researchers should bring some smiles to many faces because the study shows that a few cups of morning joe might be just what your heart needs to function at a higher level. Our chief health editor, Dr. Nandy, is here with more on the good news. Had uh, three and a half cups this morning, Doc. Ooh. Good for you, Dave. <laughs> See, I'm, I'm one of those guys with a big smile, too, so it, it was amazing. So I, I posted on, on WXYZ's Facebook page, and I said, how many cups of coffee was ideal and had a ton of responses? So here's one of them. Tamara Dawn said a pot in the morning and a pot at night. So at least eight cups a day, unless it's extremely hot out and then it's less. I also use cream and sugar, can drink it black. Don't love that, but you know, uh, Tamara, thanks. You know, it's, it's, it's amazing. The, it looks like about four to five cups is the sweet spot. Helps to uh, have the cells uh, work efficiently and blood vessels to actually grow, so good stuff there. Uh, the American Association of Cardiology actually says that it's safe for most people to consume up to six cups of coffee a day. And if you go above that though, you run the risk of a rapid heartbeat and other health problems. So try to keep it below six. And here's the important stuff. Do not pound the, the cream and sugar because you take away a lot of the health benefits. Another Facebook comment, Francis Wilcox writes, no coffee, big tree dink, uh, drinker. And is that okay for heart health? So great question, uh, Francis, for that. I've got two examples. You got your uh, Earl uh, Grey tea and also green tea. Good stuff, so keep drinking the tea, I think it's fine. And here's the thing is that, uh, you know, what happens is that if you have enough caffeine and this, this you know, bag of tea uh, will be able to give you the caffeine, that'll be just as useful. So if you drink tea or, or coffee, keep it up. And this is, this, is, uh, this is great stuff though, I think, for people who drink coffee, it's, it's beneficial. But I have to reiterate, it doesn't mean you go get that sweet drink full mm -hmm. of crap and that's the same thing. Uh, just black, Doc. That's, that's the way yeah. I like it. I appreciate Good for that. You. All right. All right. Live in front of the Starbucks machine <laughs> there, Dr. Nandy. If you have we a question it. or a health concern for the good doctor, you can email him at drnandy at wxyz.com or send it to us on Facebook and Twitter. We'll get it right to him.